So here's a diagram of an electric bell and we need to describe how the bell operates when the switch is closed. So here's our circuit with a battery, a switch, the adjustable contact is making contact with the iron armature at the moment. And iron is a conductor so it is part of the circuit and then the circuit continues in the coil of the electromagnet and we need to just label the, the uh, iron core of the electromagnet and then that circuit is completed back to the battery. So let's describe what happens when we close the switch. So we can say when the switch is closed number one a current will flow in the circuit because the circuit becomes complete. A current flows in the circuit and that will switch on the electromagnet. Switching on the electromagnet. Number two. So the iron core of the electromagnet then becomes magnetized and that will attract the iron armature towards it. So the iron core becomes magnetized magnetized and attracts the iron armature iron armature and the iron armature is on a spring so it can be pulled inwards number three so when that iron armature is pulled inwards the hammer will ring the bell so the hammer rings the bell hits the bell but when that happens the circuit is broken because the iron armature comes away from the adjustable contact so we can say but the circuit is broken by the armature moving away from the adjustable contact adjustable contact at number four so the current in the circuit stops the current in the circuit stops and that switches off the electromagnet and demagnetizes the iron core switching off the electromagnet and demagnetizing the iron core so when that happens the spring then can pull the hammer and armature back and that makes contact again and the process then repeats so we just fit that in here hopefully number five the spring pulls the hammer and armature armature back 
which makes contact again. Makes contact again. Causing a current to flow and repeating the process. The process repeats. So we go right up to the top again, a current then flows in the circuit, switching on the electromagnet and so on. So I hope that makes sense, a sort of five-step process uh, for an electric bell.